Hi guys, welcome back to another FSD 12.5.1.1 video. This is still the latest version of the FSD. We're gonna just drive around today, I'm going to shack a shake shack and see how this thing performs. I'm gonna try to see if I have to intervene at any point or if it's just gonna just drive me by itself to my destination and we're not gonna face any problem. So let's see. A lot of you watch these videos guys so I would like request you to please consider subscribing uh, and you know provide your feedback in the comment section down below on how I can improve these videos going forward as well. I try to keep these videos uncut so that you can actually see how the drive went by and you know if I had faced any situations where you know FSD didn't perform as well or like it should have done something different. So. I just uh, document all of this using these videos so please feel free to subscribe watch some other content on the channel I try to make latest videos about FSDs okay so far we had stopped at a stop sign and it very naturally moved forward and you know made the right turn now we are approaching a stoplight slowing down very gradually so it becoming natural and natural every single time there is an update to the FSD like you know how your car stops at a stoplight or like then picks up from a stoplight or a stop sign you know it is like pretty much like you're driving yourself let me just quickly show you my settings too I'm on the chill mode from my pedal perspective and my autopi autopilot settings are pretty much similar to in my previous videos I am on the assertive mode right now and uh, you know my automatic set speed offset setting is on now in my last video on the highway I showed you how uh, the impact is if you turn this setting on minimal lane changes for current drive it drives really better on the highway when you do that right so um, if you haven't checked that out check my last video it was on that topic and the car was eventually staying in the middle lane not driving in the fast uh, left lane throughout my you know route on the highway so something that I discovered yesterday and I shared with you guys in my previous video so do check that out perfect so we have a USPS van stopped in front of us so car is slowing down moved around it as you can see very naturally I didn't have to do anything far I haven't intervened at all as you guys can see so speed limit is 45 here sorry 40 here and it's going at 45 ish which is fine it is determining that based on its own AI neural networks whatever you call it um, it has actually gotten better in the 12.5 stack as compared to 3.6 in the 3.6 stack it was continuously driving 10 12 miles over the speed limit but it's now fine it's within five miles or so I would say okay we are approaching a stop sign so let's see okay moving forward creeping forward a little bit okay gonna be making a left from here now if you watch my previous videos I did cover <clears throat> in my previous video this lane is technically meant for going straight but there's a right lane here which only turns right if you can see like the cars are turning right then there's a left only lane on the other side so this lane is pretty much going straight so FSD or like Tesla did not fix that issue yet it is there in every single version of FSD as uh, you can see so we're gonna be making a left but like this lane is meant for people who are going straight okay we made the turn and there's a car merging too so we slow, slowed down perfectly fine 
no issues at all it handled the situation really well as you can see no intervention from my side as yet perfect speed limit is 55 we are going at 56 With 12.5.1.1, uh, I noticed that you know the decision making ability for the FSD has really uh, improved. Like it's taking calls uh, at a much faster rate. So let's say if you're approaching a yellow light and you think that you can go without like light becoming red, it will do so. And now in this case, as you can see, there was so much distance. We, there was no way we were going to make this yellow light so it is stopping ahead of time and very gradually coming to a full stop so very natural again and really really great to see these updates coming car is slowly creeping forward by the way I just keep my foot next to the pedals and never get like completely comfortable I just want to be ready to take control in case like you know anything which I think FSD is not gonna be able to handle but like it didn't happen so far in the last six seven months other than like you know if you see a pothole and you know like the FSD is not gonna care for that you do take care uh, take control right away and then move around it so that's the only thing which has not improved so far in so many versions of FSD you know there's still no pothole detection but again I think I'm asking for a lot <laughs> but uh, you know it's a vision based system so I, I know like you know at some point they may introduce something to tackle that situation too but something I always bring up in all of my videos and I have sent feedback to Tesla several times as well that they need to come up with some mechanism or some kind of logic to avoid or go around the potholes well, to tell you the truth these tires are really expensive especially the 21 inch wheels each tire is gonna cost you around like 500 plus dollars so you don't want to be destroying your tires by hitting the potholes and FSD basically does hit potholes it doesn't care for them luckily I don't have a lot on this road so we are fine but I'm always paying extra attention to see the road ahead of me as well while I'm driving and even when I'm recording these videos okay so this will be interesting I think we have to go around and okay it's doing so it's coming in the right lane slowly perfect stopping for the red light again perfect no issues at all okay so you see like how softly or gradually it moved from the stop that's what I'm talking about right this is really great okay so we'll be making a left from here and 
our destination is close by it's only one minute away just wanted to show you one of my you know daily you know commutes not like somewhere going far but like very close i'm just going to shake shack just to grab a bite but uh FSD is driving me there completely on its own. I didn't have to do anything so far. <laughs> awesome. Guys, I think I have a Performance Model 3. Oh yes, you guys can see it now. Model 3 Performance. Looks good. The sign that I have on my plaid it's a little bit different on the Model 3. I think it's bluish, not red-ish. Well, it looks good. Rear tires are heavy on this Performance Model 3. But we are not going to follow that. We are approaching our turn. As you can see, it's going into the plaza. We have a stop sign coming up. Let's see if it's going to stop. It is stopping for the stop sign. Perfect. Moving forward a little bit. Made that turn without any problem. And still I haven't touched the yoke at all. As you can see. Let's see where it's going to park. Okay. So it's still going. I'll let it go. Let's see what it's going to decide. Where they're going to stop. I think that's good enough. I'll just take care from here. And let's park the car. Right here. Perfect. Guys, so please comment in the comment section down below. Please consider subscribing. Do let me know your feedback. And I'm going to see you in the next one. I hope you like this video. Take care. Goodbye.